Hi everyone, it's me Wendy and I want to show you the journal I've been using daily. It's a trash journal that I made out of junk mail, things that were destined to go in the trash, and I use it as a daily journal now. I do it the same way that I've been doing my Fobonichi, but I don't do it in that book anymore, I do it in this. So I'm going to show you what I did and how I made it. The cover is one of these old envelopes. It was ripped and this had rusted so it was going to the trash. But instead I saved it and you can see here the color. It almost looks like leather and I did that by using shoe polish. Just regular old brown scuff cover shoe polish all over it all over it. No, I didn't put a finish on this at all. I did the front, you'll see, but not this. This is the natural shine from the shoe polish. And it's really neat. And then what I use for the pages is junk mail. Junk mail or anything. This was my printer instructions. This was a flyer I got in the mail. And I just ran this through the sewing machine. And I did a lousy job even sewing it uh, you can see on the other side I'll show you but a lousy job but it is a junk journal trashy journal and so it was okay to make sure the stitch is held I just threw glue along the seam and it's held up really nice I'm going to show you how I've been using it here's the seams as you can see what a mess but it works it holds well and here's the front. Now this also was trash. This was from my cruise that I went on. One of the things that they sell art. And I just liked all the little pictures. So I threw it on there. Because I really had no idea what to do with the cover. So there it is. I may put more. I may not. I don't, I don't know yet. Now inside, just on the cover, this, even though the envelope had a pocket... This one does not. I glued it shut. Like I said, this whole thing was ripped, so I just glued it shut. So there's no pockets. I used an old map as a cover, and now I've just been laying stuff down that I have loose on my desk. Maybe some pieces of washi. Uh, my library receipt. Just junk to go on the cover. <laughs> and now these are the pages. This here, it's my daily page, is this page. But I cover it up either by, this one I painted. I painted the page, the background, the green. I painted it. And see, I painted that one pink. And then I glue, either I glue, some of them I write on. I can still write on it. I don't know if you can see this very well. I write on it. This one I painted. This was the sail flyer. This, see the sail flyer? I just painted over it because I don't necessarily want the sail flyer as the background. It's busy enough as it is. That would just, oh my gosh, that would blow my mind. <laughs> so that's what I did. Painted this one as well. Now this is the other half of the sail flyer. It flipped out. So I just put it as another day. So that's two days there. Open it. It's two days here. Still paint. I painted that and you can still see through the background that's okay I'm, I'm fine with seeing through it just not having it bold this I glued on a sandwich wrapper that my son had gotten at a restaurant he had gone to this is more paint and I just glue little notepads stickers the little cut out from the sale flyers this one I glued a napkin on. I don't know if you can see the background very well. That's a napkin and then I added a little bit of I think just paint over the top just to soften it. This piece the paper was so small and fine that I just folded a piece of scrapbook paper in half and glued it to the piece of paper that was there. I've, I've learned a few things. I don't want the smaller pieces of paper in here. I want the bigger pieces. Uh, let me see if I can show you what I mean. I think actually that might have been an envelope. I'm not sure, but see, see how small this is? 
that's unusable to me. So what I'll do is just glue, like I said, fold the piece of scrapbook paper in half and glue over top of it. And then that'll give me a big enough page. This was a envelope and I kept it as envelope, but then it was too small. So all I did was unglue the sides and now this is one page. And behind there I put a little door just because it looks kind of neat. <laughs> it still had the little, it was Publishers Clear in House, so I just covered up some of it. Some of it's still there. Here's the other side of the envelope for a whole nother day. This was just a flyer. It already looked like that. I just glued a piece of paper on there. Boring. Same thing here. Um, and what sometimes when I didn't paint the pages, I just glued paper onto the pages. This one, what is that? I think that was just the back of the paper. So that one was nothing. That just went there. Here's a map. And I didn't cover the whole thing up. I just left it. And so that's how I have been doing this. This side I painted. This side I just glued what I needed on there. And that is how I have been making my journal. Here's another napkin page, but I'd painted behind it. And then I painted the, these. Another napkin page. Just glued paper on. And that, that is how I'm using my junk journal. Here's all the junk back here. This is what the pages were. Just junk mail. Mail lying around the house. Menus. That was one of the ones that I opened up. Like this one. For instance, I don't know if that's it or not. But that would be just like this menu here. I just painted the pages. And I'm having a good time with it. It's kind of neat. I'm enjoying it. And what happened, I went away. We had an out-of-town emergency. And I didn't take this with me. So what I did, I'll just show you real quick. I'm going to add this to it. This is, I don't know if you can see that. This was at one of the rest stops along the way, free hotel coupons. And it was just a book of all hotel coupons. I don't know if there's any that you can see through very well. But I just painted it when I got home because I kept a journal of what was going on. And this will be glued into, not glued, I'm sorry, I will sew this right here into this book to cover those times I was away. We had two emergency trips we had to leave on and there you have it. So, that's my trash journal to daily journal. If you have any questions, let me know. And thank you for watching. Bye, everyone.